The Meteora means middle of the sky, suspended in air, or in the heavens above, etymologically related with meteorite. It is one of the largest and most important complexes of Eastern Orthodox monasteries in Greece, second only to Montatus. The six monasteries are built on a natural sandstone rock pillars on the plain of Thessaly, near the Pindos Mountains in central Greece. You have two ways to get to Meteora. First is from Thessaloniki, but you have to drive 250 km to get there. And the second is from Larissa, and you have to drive just 100 km. Also, you can take a bus from a travel agency. About accommodation, I tell you that it is pretty bad and expensive. People usually come here to stay one night or maximum two, because following the main road, you can visit all monasteries in just one day. Meteora is a wonderful place where you can find six monasteries, four inhibited by men and two inhibited by women. I will go to visit some of them, so wish me good luck. And finally, when you get to the monastery, you have to pay a tax to visit it. In the 14th century, during the Ottoman invasion, the monks decided to build new monasteries right on the peak, the only safe place in that period of time. Here were 24 active monasteries. Kalambaka is the closest city situated at just 5 km. People started to live here thousands of years ago, but in the 9th century a group of monks moved up to this nice place. Meteora is a place where natural and man-made wonders are linked, making this place unique.
The Holy Monastery of Ran Meteoron is the largest of the monasteries located at Meteora. It was elected in the middle of 14th century and the building serves as a main museum for tourists. The Holy Monastery of Varlam is the second largest monastery in the Meteora complex. It was built in 1541 and it is dedicated to all saints. The Holy Monastery of San Stefan is a small church built in the 16th century. This monastery rests on a plain rather than on a cliff. It was damaged by Nazis during World War II who believed it was harboring insurgents and was abandoned. Nuns took it over and reconstructed it. The monastery of the Holy Trinity is on top of the cliffs and it was built in 1475. The Holy Monastery of St. Barbara was founded in the middle of the 16th century. 